uh, Jonathan Armstead. On Friday, Conan O'Brien put up an old, uh, on YouTube an old sketch that you appeared in back in the day. Put a link to that. I used to do like a, a couple of characters on Conan back, way back when. Oh, you can't. I'm putting my earpiece in. Oh, you can't hear me. Uh, I didn't know that. You didn't know that? Benjamin did a bunch of those. I played the big, the, I, I, I played a couple of characters. I remember one, I can't remember what outfit I was in, but I think Spike Lee was on the show that day and we were both sitting in the green It was room. his first game back in Madison Square Garden last night. Oh. Um, I'm back. And S Spike Lee, and I'm sitting there and I can't remember what I was wearing, but it was like some just ridiculous outfit. And I'm sitting there and he just sort of like, it was like, yeah, you know, you, you're making it, show business, that type of thing. Oh really? There was it was a quality of like you know, yeah you know how to. I mean it was a ridiculous outfit and uh, I can't remember what. It was. But uh, uh, Jonathan Arm said uh, send the link to that. And anyway, he goes on uh, old sketch you appeared in back that you once said that you worked with Conan and were shocked that a partner of his was Henry Kissinger's son. Was that an awkward at the time given your politics? Um, no, uh, Henry Kissinger's son worked as a uh, worked works as. A, an executive for the production company. And um, I wasn't I, I wasn't shocked that Conan was working with, I mean, I, you know, and I, uh, you know, feel very strongly. You don't, you don't, you know, impart the sins of the father onto the son. And mm -hmm. we never, we've never really, and I still talk to the guy on occasion and he listens to the show and he, uh, you know. I'm, oh, no way. He, he Hi, likes Conan. the show. Uh, no, not Conan. Oh. Um, and who does? Uh, Kissinger's son. Kissinger's son. And, oh, sorry. Um, and he knows my politics, and so um, and and I, you know, who knows? Who who? You know, you can't really know what the relationship is. Um, and but I think his politics are probably not. Oh well, that the was like the stupidest father. stuff, right? Like it's yeah, you you can have completely different politics from your parents. You can rebel against your parents. You can. You know, like like Tulsi fans, when I was criticizing her, like dug up my parents, like political affiliations and like my mom's, you know, fundraise for Gillibrand. And like that was got me. That's why I went after Tulsi Gabbard. <laughs> of course. Well, everybody knows there's a huge like uh, Gillibrand is trying to get uh, Gabbard get Tulsi, out of the right? Yeah. Um, that whatever you just sent me was like impossible. He sent me the link. I really want to see it. Wait, 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 here it is. Hold on. That okay. face I'll look that at is it. usually covered by her phone. The lost ring. Has... I don't even remember any of that. Uh, now, uh... I don't remember any of that. Oh, wait. Is that Benjamin? Yeah, it's Benjamin. This issue. Oh, yeah, there it is. That is actually the thing. So I'm dressed as a bear, I think. Wait, is that me? No. Hello. I am your bear. No, that's not me. That's Benjamin there. I don't know. I'll look at it later. Sorry, folks. Um, all right. Uh, let's go. Um, oh, we're going to take phone calls today, too. Sam, you're in this. I am? What is it? Did you find it? Brendan's. <laughs> Better to be horny than dead. Well, right. congratulations, Bear. You just made the devil look good, all right? Would you just please say one thing about the ring? What's a ring? Sorry, I'm oh. late, fellas. I was on the can. Hey, who are you? <laughs> hey, come on! Hey, don't! Stop! Oh. Somebody, stop! Somebody help! Oh, my God! Somebody do something! Oh, my God! Stop, Bear! No! Oh, God! Oh, my God! That human! <laughs> Please. Please. Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, this is the worst Jesus. thing that's ever happened on my shoulders during a show. We're gonna take a break. We'll be right back with Frederick. I'm so. Oh, right, there you go. You were the angel. How beautiful. Yeah, I totally forgot about that. Um, I've always thought of you as a cherub. Yeah. Well, I mean, that's. That's smoking. A... I, I guess I was smoking a cigar back then. <laughs> it was. Uh, yeah, that was back when I was a member of the Mug Club. <laughs> 
Uh, I was probably a prop, but I have a feeling that's what I was wearing. The angel outfit when, and I, I, I bet you that Spike Lee was on that show. It's also possible. I was doing other, um, other really embarrassing guests, you know, uh, stuff like that as well in the past. I mean, getting out by the masturbating bear is there. Yeah, that was pretty good. And I used to do a thing where I was, um, I was, uh, a creepy guy who would stand behind Max Weinberg. While he was playing drums, I would just stay there. Oh, okay. And I would just sit there and just go like this. <laughs> That's just why I was staring at him. 